we got the start of a triple header between Abbotsford and Calgary, and both teams still have plenty to play for. For the 10th time this season, it's the Canucks and Wranglers going head to head. Should be a good one. Thanks for tuning in, folks. My name is Brandon Astle. Zach Chitari with room behind the net. Stick handles, brings it on front. He shoots and hit the post. What a chance for his first goal. The Canucks showed great patience. Looking for an option. It comes to the point. Chitari keeps it down low for Nielsen. Out of the right corner. Nielsen behind the net. Stops. Michigan and he couldn't get it to go. Oh, he tried it and nearly buried it top shelf. The Canucks aren't done. Look at them go to work. Here's Rappa with a shot and he scores. Jack Pot. Nielsen was denied on the Michigan behind the net. The Canucks kept going. What a shot from Jack on a special evening on Autism Acceptance Night. His brother back home's going nuts as Rathbone with a couple of fist pumps makes it one nothing Canucks. Colton Poolman up ice. Brooks gave it away to Dowling. He's got Carlson in front. Dowling to Carlson and a great save by Dansk. Sliding to his right. Keeps it out with his right pad. Over to the right wing for Hoaglander. Hoaglander to Wu. Now Klimovich, top left circle, with a shot, scores! Back to back game to the goal for Danila Klimovich. Blocker side on dance, gets a power play goal, and the Canucks lead it 2 0. Throw it on net, kids, good things happen. He'll try the left side for Hunt. Snapshot. Clap in front, Seelaws with a great save on Jones, and he put a backhander wide. And now the Wranglers turn it over, here's Hoaglander the other way, behind the defense, and now he's on a breakaway! Hoaglander shoots, and he missed the blocker side! Tried to fake a slap shot, let a quick snapper go, but Dance kept it out. Carlson protects, drops it off for Nielsen in front for Dowling, in front, Dowling can't drag it past Dance, who covers. Nice three-man passing play there between Carlson, Nielsen, and then Dowling. Canucks have time to break out with it. Long pass the other way, on the tape, finds Baines. He's got Gatcombe behind the fence. Baines to Gatcombe, stopped by Dansk. What a passing play, and Gatcombe was denied by the right pad of Oscar Dansk. And Baines will get it to the right corner. Klimovich is there, shoots it back into the corner, and Klimovich was decked. He's in some pain on his stomach, as the fans want to call, not going to get one, who hit him at the same time from behind, and he didn't see it coming, and that was actually a headshot from Gallant. The fans are unhappy that there isn't a white sweater going to the penalty box. And now we're gonna have a fight at center. That's gonna be Canna Kleepert and Gallant. Here we go. Fans on their feet, and here we go. Canna Kleeper can throw him. Gallant getting a right free. Canna Kleeper responds. Gallant still throwing bombs to his right. Canna Kleeper not going away. He loses his helmet. They're trading haymakers. Now Gallant with a left. Canna Kleeper responds to the left. Look at him go! Kenneth Kleeper knocks Gallant's helmet off! They are throwing bombs! An uppercut from Gallant! They're getting tired and down they go! What a fight! Oh, it doesn't get much better than that! Give Gallant credit answering the bell after that hit on Klimovic. And Kenneth Kleeper, who's a fan favorite, Gets a standing ovation as he goes to the penalty box. Eight seconds ago, the countdown is on as the puck is dropped all the way down towards Seelos. And for the first time all season, the Calgary Wranglers get shut out and the Canucks beat the number one team in the American Hockey League. An absolute gem. Two nothing is the final from the Fraser Valley.